unknown yet radiant, Armenia was historically located between the Black, the Caspian and the Mediterranean seas, comprising a territory of around 400,000 square kilometers. Nowadays, the Republic of Armenia is located in the northeast of ancient Armenia and shares a border with Georgia, Azerbaijan, Iran and Turkey. Over the course of many millennia, the combination of the impressive spiritual strength of the successive Armenian populations and their incredible capability to adapt gave rise to a seemingly invincible Christian race, now considered to be one of the oldest civilizations in the world. Since independence from the USSR in 1991, this small country of about 30,000 square kilometers has become an industrious and modern nation capable of pleasing the most demanding tourist. Visiting Armenia means entering humanity's purest traditional roots and discovering one of the most fascinating legendary enclaves of Europe. The echoing sound of the duduk, a flute made from the wood of the apricot tree and a symbol of Armenian identity, fills the Garni temple. Its melody evokes the past of a people that date back to the third millennium BC. Armenia arose and prospered between the southern Caucasus, the Iranian plateau and Asia Minor and for long periods of its history has been occupied by Persians, Romans, Arabs, Byzantines, Mongols and Turks. With the arrival of Tigran the Great to the throne, an age of magnificence dawned. During his reign, the Armenian territory stretched from the Caspian Sea to the Mediterranean and Egypt. Five centuries later, the creation of the unique Armenian alphabet helped generate a wealth of exceptional manuscripts and parchments. The deportations and massacres committed by Turkey culminated in the genocide of 1915 and as a result Armenians fled all over the world. Today the Armenian population totals 10 million. Three million live in the motherland and the rest is made up of diaspora in 120 countries. Yerevan is the capital and largest city of Armenia. It is an outdoor treasure with more than 40 museums and many of the country's 4,000 monuments. It is also an enormously hospitable city where one can feel the values of a country characterized by peace, security and political stability. The perfect place from which to explore the vast riches of a land that for centuries has struggled to survive between its neighbors. <laughs> 